Retrospectors. Six ball puzzle, guys. Maybe you've heard of it, but most likely you haven't. This is one of those games that uh, I'm surprised that people aren't like blowing up about how great it is. But uh, I can't blame it because this is kind of hidden, I guess, in the sense that I mean I've had this game for a week and I just started playing this mini game. So right now what I'm trying to do is make something called a hexagon. So basically the object of the game is to make six uh, match six. But if you match six in a certain shape, you can drop, you can do a lot of damage to the other player by dropping a bunch of balls on their screen. So I have two here. So right now I can do a hexagon right there. That's pretty much the best thing you can do in this game. Uh, right now I can actually do a triangle too, so let's get that going. And yeah, I might win actually really fast. Uh, normally I don't do this kid. I got kind of lucky, I think. So let's see if I can get any more purples. Oh no, that's actually, that ship has sailed. All right, there it is. Uh, I've never won that fast before. But yeah, you gotta make uh, either a line or a triangle or the hexagon, and you will drop a bunch of balls on their screen. And you know what, let's play again. Let's get another game going because that was just so fast. I'm not like some amazing player at this game at all. Like I will get my shit kicked in in this game. I, I mean, some people in this game are just really good. And uh, I was kind of wondering, like, since this game kind of has ripoffs of other games, like Ludo is a ripoff of, you know, Trouble and Life, I think, or one of those two. And Last Card is just a ripoff of Uno. So this game has stuff like that. And I was always wondering, like, is there going to be a ripoff of, like, Tetris or Puyo Puyo? Because I'm a big fan of both Puyo Puyo and Tetris. And I guess this game is as close as we're going to get is Six Ball Puzzle. So that guy that left is now versing me again. Mm, I don't blame him for wanting to find... He probably thinks I'm, like, really, like, amazing. And it's this is one of those games where, like, if you're just going to get your ass kicked, then you definitely would probably better off not playing at all. But uh, he doesn't realize that. I'm actually not... I just got lucky there. So... He doesn't need to be intimidated. I need a double yellow to get that hexagon going. Let's just keep going and going until I can get that double yellow. I might be sabotaging myself for doing that. Let's get that hexagon. I don't want him to get any combos. There we go. Look at all that junk I had to, just to get that hexagon. Look at all that junk I put on my screen. Okay, now that I did that, let's uh, clear some shit. Ooh, a triangle. There I am getting lucky again, man. Seriously. Oh, I didn't want that. That's not good. So 
So let's just hope that he uh, kind of loses because uh, there's so much shit going on over there. Because I am not really setting up any uh, com any uh, pyramids or lines or hexagons right now. Kind of just hoping that he loses. And it looks like he's going to. There it is again. This guy probably thinks I'm like really good. I got him with a hexagon and a triangle, both games. And I promise that the uh, the hexagon I did try to make that triangle was just complete luck. But yeah, I mean, seriously, this is a really good looking game. And if you if you blast the music, I mean, if you're a fan of the music, which I am, uh. I mean, seriously, somebody out there, I can't be the only one that likes the music for that game. Somebody out there is going to make some crazy, like, uh, dance remix of that song, and it's going to be sick. So that's Six Ball Puzzle, and uh, I definitely recommend checking it out. And I would recommend also, because some people, when you play online, are just so amazing at that game, that I would recommend at least trying to beat the CPU in Impossible Mode before you even, uh, like, just beat the game, the beat the shit out of the game in single player mode, and then go online with it, because, yeah, people are crazy. But yeah, cool game, pretty game, good music. Uh, this has got to be easily in my uh, top uh, uh, top 10 games for, for this entire collection. Peace out.